So in this video we are going to uh, see the main feature of our tank. Just uh, to open our tank tool, just double click on the executable auto tools uh, jar file. And then you see uh, the interface of uh, our tank tools. We have first to set the connection with the AirTalk server and here you have the uh, you can define the location of uh, the AirTalk server here. The AirTalk server is running on localhost with the default uh, default port of uh, AirTalk, so uh, 8042. Uh, and then I'm just going uh, to submit my settings and then I got the connection of our, uh, with our tank. Uh, I can search for a patient. For example, I can search a patient with a, a, a name starting by A. I'm going to search over my server. Yeah, I, I got all my anonymized uh, patients uh that started by a this is my uh, uh, uh tank uh, content and uh, then i can also uh, i did some filter as uh, uh, some specific uh, study description searching for for example this i want to select description starting with quality control then i have all the studies starting by quality control and i can even filter by modalities, such as if I want only PET, or there is no only PET, or only nuclear medicine. And this, I got my uh, studies with uh, containing nuclear medicine uh, modalities. Uh, so then I can uh, read images, so I can use open images to read images. This is much more powerful if you run this tool into a uh, Fiji an environment. I will make a separate video to show you the capabilities of running uh, our tongue tools in, in Fiji, which allows a full image processing capabilities. Uh, then I have some feature uh, in uh, the panel, this is a tool panel. I can anonymize studies. Uh, but uh, this is will be described in a, another video. I can export uh, my DICOM. I can select either studies or all patients, all uh, all studies of the, this patient is added in the list, and I can choose to export uh, this DICOM into a zip file, a DICOM dear structure zip file or uh, merge the zip with a uh, viewer distribution. We propose a distribution, uh, viewer distribution based on Fiji, but you can also use other distribution, viewer distribution like or uh, Radiant or another to, uh, software you like. It just f f merge the DICOM file with the viewer into the final zip or even ISO file if you want to burn on the CD. So I can make a zip file going to choose where my zip is going to locate and then I will get a proper zip with all selected DICOM in it. So that's uh, for uh, the export. You can also choose to delete some data. Here you can select a patient. We have selected seven studies in of this patient and I can choose to delete it. It will remove from my Autonk server all the DICOMs. I have also access into right click to delete a series or delete a studies or delete a patient. Also we can edit some information of the DICOM here I, I can if I click on modify I can choose to change the study description like quality control protocol test and I change to modify it will create the new seri modified series. I can remove the last one if I want or keep the two uh, modified series. It's just a matter of taste. I'm going to delete the old one, etc. So uh, that's for the the, the tools uh, of uh, Orton Tools uh, software. So let's look at the queries uh, 
uh, capabilities, this button opens the query to query your uh, other uh, uh, local uh, AAT uh, from your network. So here I have a distant uh, DICOM node. I'm going to search for uh, studies that started by nuclear medicine. Uh, sorry, I have to make in capitals. Okay, and I, I get uh, my results and here is uh, the quality control of this day. Uh, I can change the range of uh, church and I can retrieve either a study. When I click you see the series level and I can retrieve either a study or a, ser a series and this re will retrieve the data in my uh, local R tank. I can also use the query display history and this search for the selected patient into a second uh, AET. Here, uh, this server is empty, but if I get in this server, it will search for the whole history of this patient uh, stored in another uh, DICOM node, which could be uh, a PAX uh, of the PAX of the uh, hospital. And then, of course, I can retrieve whatever I want in my local R tank. The last tab is for auto retrieve, and this was presented in another video. So that's all for this video. We are going to continue in another video to show the auto query retrieve.